Hi, welcome to video number four in our 13 colonies map. Uh, we did the regions in the last video, and today we're going to pinpoint some of the larger cities throughout the 13 colonies, those areas where uh, a little bit higher populations are, where people settled. Um, and uh, there's about 10 cities that we want to put on, put on the map. Um, and you can add more if you'd like, but uh, we'll let's go through a bunch of uh, the bigger populated areas, higher populated areas in the colonies. Um, uh, we'll start in the northeast and work our way south. Um, if you look over here in the, in the list of activities, Boston is listed first. Okay, so let's start with that city. Okay, it's in the colony of Massachusetts. And it's that little black dot right there. Now I'm gonna use a, a pencil to label the city. So you can always go over it later with a pen if you'd like, but it's always best to start with a pencil. And I'm gonna write it a little off to the side. I think I'll use what they call a leader line. I'll just put like a little line out to this open area. And I'll put a capital B, O, S, T, O, and Boston with a little line pointing to that dot. Okay, so that's, that's the city of Boston right there. Um, Boston Harbor. Okay. All right. Let's um, let's check that off in the list over here. We'll check them off as we go. Okay. Um, let's do. Let's go over to Plymouth. That's a, a famous city in the colony of Massachusetts. And once again, I'm going to use a a little leader line so I can write it a little bit bigger off to the side. I'll write it right about here. If you notice, I'm trying to keep my words um, nice and level. A little bit easier to read if it, rather than on an angle. If so if you can help it, try to, and once again, you can use that little leader line. Try to keep your words nice and level. Okay, you can see how that was done with the, uh, the colony names as well. Okay, we'll check off Plymouth. Okay, let's get into the colony of Rhode Island. There are two cities in Rhode Island that I'd like to label. Um, there's this one right here. I'm gonna put a little leader line so I can write it below the word Rhode Island. That's the present day capital of Rhode Island, Providence. But there was one other uh, city, which I believe was the capital back in the days of the uh, colonies. I think Newport, the city of Newport was the state capital. And it's a little hard to see, but it's there's, a, there's an island right here in Narragansett Bay, and, and there's a city located on that island. You can just put like a little line like this going to that. There's a little dot right there. And uh, we'll write Newport. It fits well right above, it fits nicely right above that word, Rhode Island. These are the harder ones to label on the map because it's very uh, kind of a very um, tight area. So not a lot of room to write the words, so we're having to use that leader line method. Okay, so I'm going to check that off in the list. Providence and Newport. Okay. Um, now we've got uh, the large city of um, New York. There's the little dot for New York. And I believe that, um, I'm gonna put in parentheses, New Amsterdam, because I think it was called that at one time too. Your teacher can um, discuss that. 
that's necessary to, to put in. I'm just going to put in for fun. All right, now let's check off Newport on uh, New York. All right, now going further south, I've, I've actually gone ahead and labeled some of these ahead of time so that you can you can see see it uh, on the map. And you can go ahead and position it just above that little dot right there. That's the city of Philadelphia. So P-H-I-L-A-D-E-L-P-H-I-A. -E -E Try to position it so that it's close to the dot, maybe right above the dot. It fits pretty well there. Okay, check off Philadelphia. Uh, let's do um, Williamsburg. That's the, the dot right there in Virginia. There are two very close. Williamsburg and this one here is Jamestown. I ended up writing it. Then I was a little far away from the dot, so I put the leader line pointing to it. Same thing with Jamestown. I ended up putting a little line pointing to the dot. Okay, so I'll check those two off. Um, let's see, we've got Savannah. Uh, wait a second. I haven't done Charleston yet. Let me check off Williamsburg. Haven't got to Charleston yet. Okay, the, uh, going further south though, um, we you do see a dot right here, and that's Charleston, South Carolina. I was able to write it right above the dot. C-H-A-R-L-E-S-T-O-N. Okay, and then a little further south in Georgia is right along the coastline, that little dot there is Savannah. S-A-V-A-N-N-A. -N -N -A. I wrote it off to the in this open area of the ocean. Okay, and you can check off uh, Charleston and Savannah. Now, there are there were plenty of other cities as well, but these are the, um, the highly populated cities. There were other ones. You can add other ones too as you continue to study uh, some of the other cities within the colony. So feel free to add more if, you, if your teacher wants you to do that. Okay. Um, thanks very much, and um, in the next video, maybe we'll try to sketch in the uh, rivers. Okay, but good luck. Thank you.